Hey guys, so it's a little later in the day. Um, my auntie's gone to church, so I am currently on my way to Walmart. Um, I was on the on FaceTime to my best friend, um, so I didn't get to. Sh- oh god, I didn't get to show you guys where um, my auntie lives. But the house is stunning, like it's absolutely beautiful. Um, like my best friend said, I'm gonna get off the phone so I can cross properly. Um, yeah, I'm gonna get off the phone so I can cross properly. Um, so I will see you guys later. Oh my god, I've got 30 seconds to cross. It's proper. What's going on? What's going on? Oh my god. And I forgot that the roads are. Wow. Oh. Oh. There's a railway as well. Oh my god. I don't know what I'm doing. All I know is that I'm, I'm walking as fast as I can. Oh my god, guys. I'm actually in a foreign land. It's so humid. And I slicked, I slicked my hair today. I slicked it. Um, and I'm probably most likely going to get frizzy hair by the end of the day, which is great. Right there. Um, and I might find my husband there. Who knows? He's probably grinding his ass off. And I'm going to come with my British self <laughs> and um, take him away. No, I'm kidding. I'm not kidding. I'm kidding. I'm gonna go in. I feel like people are looking at me weird because I'm holding my phone um, more than me. Um, what do you call it? Than the fact that I'm actually British. Oh, thank you. Um, but yeah, I'm just gonna see what happens and go with it. Okay, so we're in Walmart now. It kind of looks like Asda. We tried these before, so I'm gonna go and get them because I always see like videos talking about them. So yeah, I'm gonna get these. And I found these Mike and Ikes. I tried them one time from Tesco's and I really, really like them. Um, but anyone who knows me knows I love Lipton peach tea. So I'm gonna get it because look at the price. Oh my God. Oh my gosh. That heat just hits you. Hopefully they taste really nice. I'm very excited to try it. I might even do like a British girl tries American sweets video. <laughs> just because that will be fun to do. Um, but yeah, I just need to find my way out of this car park and hopefully not get hit by a car because that's like the last thing that I want to happen right now. Um, but yeah. This is the most confusing device I've come across. Like, you press it and you have to wait, but then it's saying that it shouldn't show one of the symbols, but then one of the symbols is showing while it's telling you to cross. So I'm like, I'm not trying to die while I'm on holiday. So um, I literally leg it across the road. Right, so I literally just got back from Walmart. Um, my Aunt Maggie is still at church, so um, yeah. Anyway, I got the biggest version of my favorite drink. Lipton peach tea. So look how dense it is. But it's so sweet. Like the one in the like now I understand sugar tax because this is sweet. Like this could give me diabetes. <laughs> I was about to eat these. I was. But I thought I should probably get myself on camera eating them. So Why do we not have these in the UK? They're actually really nice. And you take and they're really nice. That's me now. So this area that my aunt lives in is called Saxi. And guys, it is stunning. Like, I literally feel like I'm in California, but I'm not. Like, it's actually beautiful. I'm trying to walk in a straight line 
because our house is like back down that way. But um, I'm trying to walk in a straight line so I don't get lost. But I want to go exploring because one, the weather's nice. And two, like, I don't want to do like touristy things and like go to the centre. Like, I want to explore where I am now. Um, but yeah, yeah, I'm babbling on now. But look how beautiful this place is. Absolutely beautiful. On my way to Walmart. I've like spent most of my day with my aunt's kids. And they are like the cutest little things ever. And they always have so much questions. But so, do, so does every 10 or 6 year old so it doesn't really bother me per se but um but they're so adorable like they have like hella questions about the uk and what the uk is like um and stuff so it was just like entertaining them it was kind of like being at home with my little brother and sister to be honest um but obviously this is honestly one of the best things i've ever done and i would recommend it to anyone to take a trip on a holiday by yourself to texas actually stunning and this is already day one so there's too many more beautiful days in this lovely sea hey guys so my aunt has just dropped me off um, at this place called Firewheel and she said Firewheel Mall and here's me thinking it's a mall it's in town <laughs> like it's actually a town like this is not a mall um, I'll show you guys in a second but literally it's like a mini town of just shopping places and I'm I must say I'm gobsmacked like I don't I don't even know what to say there's food places left right and center there's clothes places there's cinemas uh there's just so much going on like i honestly i, d I don't know what to do with myself um but yeah it's it looks really cloudy but it's actually really warm um so even me wearing my jumper right now is kind of a silly move but it's gonna be raining later so i don't want to risk being cold when it rains but to be fair, when it rained yesterday, it was not cold. So yeah, we'll see where the day takes us. So I just went into a shop and I saw this girl in there and I basically asked her what her age was and she was 22. And she basically like recommended to me like all the good places to go to. So like I'm not in Saxe anymore. I'm actually in a in a place called Garland. Um, so she asked me if I wanted to find places in Garland or in Dallas. So she showed me two places. I'm gonna try and go there. Um, she wrote them down on a bit of paper for me. Um, but I asked her if they had anything like H&M or like um, Forever 21 because I know those are the only shops that Americans have because they don't have Primark. Like, how are Americans living without Primark? I don't understand, like it's a necessity. Um, but yeah, she said it's like past the fountain and the fountain is literally just down there. So I'm just gonna go past the fountain and try and find a shop and do some shopping. place called Pete's like burgers and wings and I'm waiting on my food but I got Sprite and the Sprite tastes so different so different what has Jamie Oliver done my hair has honestly never been this frizzy in my life um, so yeah I really underestimated the heat and the humidity and everything like that anyway if you guys are ever in Dallas, go to this place called Pete's. The food is so good. Um, yeah, it's actually really tasty. And it was really inexpensive as well, which is always a bonus. 
but I'm on my way to a shop called Macy's. Um, I don't really know what's there, but I've heard about it in like YouTube videos. So I'm basically gonna see what's in the shop, maybe do a little bit of shopping, but I don't really know what's in there, but it looks really, really big, but we'll see. and it's actually really pretty it kind of reminds me of like um Debenhams it's very similar to Debenhams um so yeah so I was sat down in front of there for like a majority of the time because I just got so hot um I saw a girl wearing a jumper she walked past me she was wearing a jumper and i thought why am i like boiling hot and why are you fine but clearly it's because i'm not used to the weather but um my aunt is on her way to pick me up she should be here in like the next five minutes or so but i got some lemonade it's like cherry flavored lemonade from on Anne's, which in the uk is a pretzel shop it's a pretzel shop here but i don't think they sell this lemonade here by here I mean there um, in England it is so good oh I can hear my name oh my aunt is here look at that there she is hey guys so today's Tuesday it's officially day three and um, I'm just a bit upset because it's raining today look how heavy it's raining like look at the street like it's so nuts so in terms of my plans a lot of the things that i want to do require me to go outside like the museum the zoo um there's a bunch of parks that i want to go to um i'm thinking of going to the shopping mall in town or in the city um but it's just looking extremely because the weather is just ridiculous today might be a lazy day but i don't really want it to be a lazy day um it's really annoying it's like i'm meant to be out and enjoying texas and i can't do that um so i'm gonna go through my list of like places that I wrote down where I want to go and then basically see what I could do but I did like google search like things to do on a rainy day in Dallas and it basically just said to go to the aquarium so I'm thinking of going to the aquarium um but we'll see we'll see train station in Plano and I'm currently on my way to I think it's like Newbury, Newbury Mall, I forgot what it's called, New Park Mall, I can't remember what it's called, um, but I can't lie, I'm really really nervous, um, but basically I have to like make a couple stops, I've got a day pass ticket, my uncle gave me like a little like food bag to put my phone in to protect it from the rain, but um, yeah I should be arriving there in like 20 minutes. Um, but the train is about to leave so yeah I'm gonna obviously take you guys on the journey and then show you guys the mall when I get there. Yeah. 